This is Gabe Afiaki, and this is Survival Guide number three. Um, so for those of you that have just joined us, um, ever since this weird shit started happening um, a couple of weeks back, I've been sharing stuff and tips with you guys <clears throat> about um, things that are, are good to have. Uh, so today what we're going to do is go over a, a proper SHTF kit, and, and if you don't know what an SHTF kit is, just go back in my other videos, you'll see it all there. Um, <clears throat> okay, whatever. Uh, so, first of all, most important, these bad boys right here, the water treatment tablets, they, you, you need to have these, but I also highly recommend having <clears throat> a micro filter, you can get one of these from any good camping store, um, and if it's not in your camping store, then it's not a good camping store, so go to a different one. Um, <clears throat> also, uh, it's just a regular spade, except it's actually got a serrated edge on it, which is really good for like <clears throat> digging loose and um, in long drops, or like if one of your mates carks it or something. Um, <clears throat> also, oh, flashlight, pretty self-explanatory. Duct tape, always does the job, eh? Um, <clears throat> some candles and a and waterproof matches. Um, undies, <laughs> gotta have clean undies. Um, <clears throat> a metal cup, cause they're really easy to sterilize and you can put lots of different stuff in them. Um, <clears throat> and <laughs> some rubbers, cause <clears throat> what's life really worth living for, eh? <laughs> um, <clears throat> Yeah, anyway, that's all, um, but I recommend that you should have at least one of these in every house. Um, I have many in my house. Um, yeah, so follow me or leave a comment or follow me on Twitter or subscribe or whatever, but I'll see you here next time with, uh, with more important things that you need to know.